My name is Deborah Kaplan, and I'm a licensed therapist, author, and speaker. As a licensed therapist, I work with issues of attachment, trauma, and sex addiction. But along with that, I work with money issues. In the, uh, before I was a licensed therapist, I was on Wall Street, and I worked in the financial markets. And it was there that I began to see the power that money had over people and that what we as human beings attach to, if it's not another individual healthy caregiver in our families of origin, might often play a very significant, albeit unhealthy, role in our lives. My book for Love and Money, Exploring Sexual and Financial Betrayal, brought together these two worlds about sex, money, and power. In my office, in my practice as a therapist, I work with couples who come in and they are often arguing, as we all do, about things that are really incidental, content versus process. And the argument may be about the washing machine, may be about children, it may be about their sexual lives that they're either having no sex, we're having lots of sex, but there's no intimacy between us. And yet, statistics show and research bears that what most couples argue about is money. Financial issues that bring a huge distress to a relationship. And what I tell couples is, what we argue about is perhaps less important than how we argue about it. In coupleships, there is a power differential. It might be age, it might be relationship, it might be education, it might be salary, it might be intellect or social entree. The fact that there might be power differentials is of lesser importance than their, how a couple deals with this power differential in their relationship. I have found that when we have an insecure attachment in childhood to a healthy caregiver over a consistent lifetime, we may attach to other items external of ourself, but yet bring great reward and great immediate gratification. Money, sex, power, drugs, alcohol, but the pursuit of wonderful things such as a better job, more money, more success, more fame, more fortune, more notoriety, more acknowledgement can become addictive unto itself and bring us really from our authentic core being. If what you've heard today interests you and or there are questions that you have, to learn more, please contact me at www.debracaplincounseling.com. Thank you.